Okay, so let's have a look at the fourth adjustment for Gill 2018. Oh, sorry, Jill 2018 manufacturing account mock paper. So it's telling us that the suspensive figure arises as a result of discount allowed entered only in the debtor's account. So discount allowed is where we give um, discount to people who buy stock from us. So this is an expense. So this is only entered in the debtor's account and not in the discount account. So we have to go and find out where is the discount. Is it on the debit side? We're going to increase it. If it's on the credit side, we're going to decrease it because discount received is on the credit side. That's an income. And then 3000 paid towards PAYE entered only in the bank account. So we paid extra 3000 towards our PAYE. So that PAYE liability is going to decrease. So um, we need to decrease the PAYE into PRSI. And then we have to find out where is the figure then in the expense. So the first one is our discount. So as usual, it's 1500 so we're going to go to the account, we're going to find our discount and on the, the trial balance we're going to put in the figure. So the discount, it's on the credit side, so we know that's discount received. So we're going to minus 1500 because we've left the discount allowed out. So this is discount received, we need to take away an extra 1500 for discount allowed. So the credit side is lower, so debits and credits must equal. So what we need to do then is take away the 1500 from our suspense, which is up here. <clears throat> so that's the first adjustment for the discount. And then we have to do 3000 then for a POI. So we've paid an extra 3000 off the POI. So that's going to be minus 3000 from the 80,000. So now the debits and credits are not equal. So now we're going to take an extra 3,000 out of our general factory overheads to balance the debits and credits. So your adjustment is going to look like this. We'll have the amount for the discount, which is 8,400. The suspense is going to reduce it. So we're going to take away 1,500. And that's going to give us 6,900. That's going to go into your add operating income or add income in your profit and loss account. The PUIE then, so the amount for the PUIE was 80,000. We got our suspense, which is 3,000. And so we're going to take them away. Because we paid an extra 3000 so that's going to be 77000 that's going to go into your balance sheet in your creditors due within one year and then your suspense then in the question 75 because it's included in our general factory overheads so you might change that to general factory overheads so the amount for general factory overheads 75000 100. Then we're going to take away the discount, which was 1,500, and then the PAYE, which was 3,000. And that then is going into a manufacturing account. So the discount. We said it was 6,900. We need to reduce it by another 100, 1,500 because that's the discount allowed that we hadn't allocated for. And that's going to go into your ad operating income. Then your POIE PRSI, which is going to go into your balance sheet as a creditor's due within one year, 77,000. We paid an extra 3,000, so we need to reduce it. So each one of these, we're on the credit side. So our credit side's down. So to balance it off, we're going to reduce our general factory overheads by the same amount. So we're going to reduce it by 1500 from our discount and reduce it by 3000 from our PUI. So you get 70,600 and that's going to go into your manufacturing account. So that's how you answer the 
for the Jostun, I think it was. For the Jostun for Gill 2018 manufacturing account, mock paper.